Hey guys, welcome to Channel College Co-op again. What we're up? We're gonna do a special video, and this time we're gonna do the, uh, oh shit, wait a minute, let me turn it down. I am setting the mood though, I suppose, right, with the right. background's noise. Right. Uh, but anyway, we're gonna be playing uh, a little demo that came out recently for the PS5, uh, known as Maiden. Uh, it's the Resident Evil beginning tie-in, basically, kind of like yeah. what they did with uh, 7, okay. sort of, yeah. I would imagine. Um, obviously, we haven't played it yet, so we're going to be experiencing this firsthand with you guys. Yeah, I'm a little bit removed from, from Resident Evil. I do love the series. We both do. That's why we decided to put this video up. Um, I played 5, I played a little bit of 6, and then I kind of drifted off for a little bit. I bailed on 7 only because I, I, like, I did want to play it, but um, I won't lie. I, I just I don't find rednecks frightening. Like, I was never really, like, you should, Ch Texas Chainsaw Massacre and stuff like that. I never really got into it just because, right. to me, <laughs> I have Red X in my family. They're, they're not scary. <laughs> like, they're dumb. <laughs> and uh, so, I don't know. So, I, that, that, I just it never really connected with me. So, I was kind of like, eh, I'm going to set this one out. They did it with Outlast 2. Okay. I they played the first one. It was in an insane asylum. And then the second one, they took it to the bayou or something like that. Right. And it was Swamp Redneck, so it was, I was kind of like, yeah. No, understandable. Uh, but yeah, I mean, we're going to take a look at the demo, see how it is. Uh, this one's different, I guess. It's kind of more based in a mansion sure. again. Yeah, like the sort first of. one, right? Yeah, sort of. So and, uh, We'll also have to see because we don't know anything about it, so you might actually see some jump This scares. is the character. This is I do know for a fact this is the character from 7. Okay. Same character. Uh, isn't Chris Redfield also in it, though? Yes. Okay. Yes, he is in this game. Well, grab, um, grab that controller. Let's get rolling. Oh, yeah. Let's do this. Do this, Mia. Uh, uh, so, like we said, this is on the PS5. Um, and we'll see what's going on. Alright. says, help. Yeah, help yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Right, that's actually great. It's not creepy at all. So uh, that's the tone. Damn it, I, I want the intro to Capcom. The Street Fighter intro uh, yeah. to Capcom. <laughs> yeah. I can't make it annoy that sound because it's really high pitch. But you know me. Right, right, right. The engine. So this will be kind of another display on uh, the visuals and how, how, how well this looks on the PS5. Oh, good God, yes. So just okay then? Okay. Uh, okay. Remember. <coughs> so I can't that? change him. <coughs> Salmon, select. Lucy snoring into the mic. It's hilarious. Is it picking it up? Oh, it was for a hot second. It's kind of funny. Okay. If it becomes a thing, I'll let you know. Okay. Crouch. And view. I want to invert the controls. Can I do that? Oh, please. God. Yes. Yes. Could go large, baby. <laughs> large. Maiden. Escape the dungeon, eh? Well, there's a chest. I'm sure there's gonna be a gun in there, right? Oh, well, it's an outhouse. <laughs> it's a toilet. It's a shitter. Oh, there's definitely not gonna be a gun in there. <laughs> Missing brick. Okay. So, gibberish? Oh. oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> whoever, whoever is trying to escape this place, I hope this note will be some of some of some <laughs> assistance. You don't know me, but you will have to trust me if you want to survive. First, you need to look out of this cell. Look around for the way. Get on your hands and knees if you must. Then search for the thing you'll need to escape. It will be hidden where they'll least expect. Soaked in blood. Hmm. 
I bet it's in a body. Once you get out of the dungeon, you will find yourself in a room. The door there won't lead to salvation. The light will lead you down the right path. Okay. You must hit a dead end, but do not give up. There should be a way to proceed hidden somewhere. Once you find the ladder, the only way is up. But watch out. Don't let them see you. I plan to make my escape tonight and pray that you, too, make it out alive. Hmm. That's not ominous at all. I think this dude's name is Ethan. Mm -hmm. uh, he's got the biggest mm -hmm. shit luck ever. What is Moldy that? Moldy bread, two slices of oh, bread. Oh, is that what it is? <laughs> That's really cool that I could figure out what that was. Alright, so I have to look out the door. And look, find my way out. Uh, so... That way. So you can get low. Maybe there's like a mouse, or not a mouse, but like some. Hmm. Oh, there's a hole there. That's what they meant by less and low. But then they say stay low? No, they said the way out is soaked in blood. The key out. Or something like that. Is it in there? Is there I hope not. And feces in there? maggots. There you go. Look, right. Looks like mushrooms, poo, and magnets. Or maggots, excuse me. Look up. Uh, it's just open. Oh. Mm. That's crazy. Now that's a torture device right there. What is it, like the rack with a bunch of needles or something? Ooh. I've stuck a lot. Ooh, look at that. Creepy. Ooh. Okay. <clears throat> little little clipping going on there. <laughs> Ooh. Could it be up there with those bodies? I just like exploring, I'm sorry. I know what it says. You're good, you're good. I just want to check shit out. It's cool. It's well done. Ooh. Alright, so exploring in this is definitely. Oh, what the fuck? Yes, so... Soaked in blood, right? Yeah. Hmm. I don't get it, though. I can't go there. I don't know. I guess not. You can't jump? <laughs> toys over there. <laughs> sure, that's oh. really what Capcom was thinking about when they were making this game. How many bondage toys can we put in the basement? It's an epic. <laughs> oh, I bet you. There it is in there. That's a lot of blood. Person ripped it in half. Oh, Jesus. They, yeah. do, they do not skimp on the gore or graphicness of this, eh? Yeah. Well, that's kind of kinky. Oh, my. Oh, there's like a key that goes in the eyeballs. Oh. Jeez. Yeah, not messing around with this game. It's out of everything. <laughs> Apparently. Something fell. 
So, riddle me this. Yeah, it says X, it's locked. Oh, okay, so it wants me... It, so maybe you need the the key out of the bloody well of... No, I, I get it, but, like, I don't... I'm talking about the controls. Like, I don't understand why it says the examine button when really it means you gotta... It, and then it pull... Oh, okay. Hi, Chihuahua. Huh. Uh, so she fell over? Yes. When? When I walked to the door and examined the lock. So now you're going to cut the lock open. Well, I have... <coughs> oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Did it fall? Yeah. That's great. This is what I was going to unlock. Bolt cutters. That is a staple. Bolt cutters in this game, yeah? Mm-hmm. Well, at least it was in two. Was it in the first game? I can't remember. Oh, oh here we go. Ah. So when it, we don't even get the key, we just get... <laughs> we get to pick a lot. <laughs> yeah. Good luck. There was another one, too, I know. Wasn't that way? That was just a room, right? Oh no, that's where I came in. Okay. Bullshit. Oh, she's gone? Oh wait, no. Okay. It's about to shit my pants. Oh no. Now something's coming. You hear that shit? Yeah. Alright, I'm shitting my pants. Doesn't look healthy either. So, this was nothing? I thought. So, you gotta lock that? Hold on to your butts. It's a stay low, right? That's a creepy. Isn't that something famous? This little... Uh, no, no, it's something different. I think it's... I know what you're talking about. It was, <clears throat> it was in Devil's Advocate, wasn't it? Maybe. That's nuts, dude. That's beautiful. That's crazy. Look at that detail. As it comes to life and starts stabbing you, it'll give you nightmares. <laughs> yeah. Watch they all move. Is that blood? Not the wine. That's blood. Is it though? It sounds like it. Or looks like it. Can't be too sure. It is definitely coming. Can you edit lose uh, snoring out of the video? <laughs> What's that? Can you edit lose snoring out of the video? Mm, probably not, no. <laughs> Put it up, guys, maybe. I'll pick her up a little bit. Yeah, you're right. It is blood. What are they eating? It's like ground up meat. Super bloody. Ooh, boy, dead flowers. <coughs> Super spooky dead flowers. <laughs> Ooh, a record player. That, that, nope. That would probably be bad. <laughs> Stinks so bad. I wish there was a zoom in button. What's up with that? 
Actually, I wasn't. I thought there was one in the last game because I played the demo, right. and that's what kind of convinced me. Like, mm, I don't know if I like. Like for this. Mild pass. I mean, a buddy of ours sung high praises, and I was kind of like, all right, I'll play it. But this one? No, no. Um, seven. Okay. Clearly, I'm gonna go in there. Grab that knife. Yeah, I, I thought if you would be able to. But no. I, this looks important to me for some reason, and I can't do anything. Oof, baby girl. Pardon? I swear that's her, not me. <laughs> Dan Smackabar. Okay. Oh, it's me doing that. Something in that cat. Yeah. It's a body, is it? I thought. Oh, maybe this is the part they said labeling, I guess. But yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's like part where it's, it's like, oh, it looks like a dead end, but fear not. Yep. Alright. <clears throat> do you, so do you think this... When I play games, I ha like, sometimes I have to take my contacts out, especially in games like this where it's very tense. Yeah. Because I don't blink, and my contacts just, just dry, dry out. <laughs> oh, man. It's the worst. So do you think this is, a uh part of the actual village, or is this, this a side quest? Oh, I'm sure. It, I'm, I, I, oh, like a... I don't know. Uh, that's a good question. That's a good question. I mean, you, you mean like a side quest in the game, the big game? Yeah, or just something that just kind of gets you thematically into the... the, the well, the, in the first demo, you met the family at the end, basically. But you're running away from the father, grandfather, or the oldest man. I, I think it was the father. But anyway, um, June 9th, <laughs> 1958. It was my first day working at the castle today. I was most shocked to see the masters of the house were all women. The mistress and her daughters were very adamant that they wouldn't bite. It was quite peculiar. Vampires. Yes. It's been two weeks since I started working at the cat. I'm sorry. My dog is farting right now. And it's like, it's killing me because I get a whiff and I'm like, oh. <laughs> Whew, baby. Another maid, Ad Adelia, uh, made a mistake, and Miss Dan Daniela slashed her face with a knife. Whew, baby. And at night, I can hear it wailing as if ghosts roam the halls. I want to go home. July 8th, 1958. I don't know what to do. The young ladies were complaining it was too hot and stu stuffy during dinner, so I opened the window just to crack. Shut it. Shut it now. They all shrieked at me in unison. I fear I may be taken down to the cellar and never be seen again. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. You dead, that's what you did. Hmm. So what is that? Exactly? Okay. Rotting food, I don't know, feces? Oh, there's a ladder upward. Yeah, it says but stay out of sight. This is the pirate. I guess a vampire wouldn't really have a mirror, would they? Or would they? <laughs> Depends on what type of mythos world you're in. Mm -hmm. mm. That 
this doesn't scream, sound <laughs> creepy at all. You're taking I think that's minutes. more for effect than anything. But that's kind of weird. It's like, yeah, the piano smash thing. Like, well, why would you do that for picking up an item? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I picked it up. Just so you know, I'm a total wimp. I'm playing other mobile games while you're playing. So yeah, so he doesn't. Yeah. So I don't get freaked the fuck out when shit happens. Comment below how much of a... Oh, I bet this is your clothing that looks like the dress from the pictures I've seen. I haven't watched the video because I kind of wanted to just experience this. Right. Well, I figure there can't be too much combat because you have... Yeah, it's basically running in this. You have a hot poker right now. And you have... Nothing. I have nothing. I have a lockpick. You have a lockpick, a note, yeah. and a necklace that what? is apparently haunted. What do I have? Yeah, I have. Oh, yeah. A necklace of oh, animals used to ward away evil. Hmm. Huh. Taken from me when I was thrown in that dungeon. Oh. Well, wait a minute. Did we... No, we didn't miss a video. Say examine, so you clearly can't go there. Oh shit, they're walking out. Is there a door back there I'll go through? Reminiscent of uh, Resident Evil 1. Yeah. I didn't play that game, but I know the main you know, uh, entrance area yeah. with the stairwell. It's the actually. Foyer. It's very much, much like Mansions of Madness, that little entrance. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> also, a great board game. <laughs> For those that don't know. <coughs> yeah. We uh, do dabble in the board games, provided, you know. Social distancing isn't too much of a thing. Yeah, no, no, it's... <laughs> put on hold. <coughs> Excuse me. So we need to find an eyeball. For the nun. Also, if you noticed in the picture of the demo, the eyes are slashed out, and then the picture of when you want to purchase a Resident Evil 8 Village, the other eye is glowing. Yeah, it's a wolf eye, actually. It wow. looks like... Nobody's down there, but I'm freaked out to go down there. <laughs> it just seems too open. Yeah, I mean... Well, Trust me, these games now are different. It's not, like, run everywhere because you can actually fight. Right. It's like, you can't fight. <laughs> you gotta run that fuck away. Uh, and it's locked, too. Oh shit! All right, so it did mention that I like a long hallway that was seemed like a dead end. I bet you ten dollars. Oh, it was the one up here. <clears throat> kind of nice. I can run. No, because yeah. Uh, it's gotta be this way. Alright. <sighs> okay. Got this. <laughs> okay, well that's just not good. See? I told you. I played one too many horror games. <laughs> Oh, God. 
Come on. Something. Candidates. Irina, Mahela, Lois, Rejects, Dendora, Greta, Nadine, Camellia, Bianca, Molina, Astrid, Ludmila, Rosa, Linda, Nina, Safana, and Gabriela. So it's keeping the girl thing alive. Yeah. So apparently, they're trying out. <laughs> There's a lot of people cut from the team. Oh wow, uh, okay. Hmm. So they drink blood. drink blood. Oh, sorry about no. Oh, she'll cut them. So, what? One fucking drawer this whole entire time. <laughs> what? Okay. Oh shit. Oh, that's right. They don't like the cold, so this room's probably safe. As it closes behind you automatically? Yeah, okay. Oh, the door? Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's because of the draft, probably. Or something's gonna fucking beat you up! Maybe. Come out of nowhere from the rafters. You would like that one. No, I, 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 I freak <laughs> out, throw my phone, and just run away. Like a little uh, child. There's something on the. There's two things in this back, right? The door and the, the, the table, and this random drawer. Always the right drawer. Okay. Maybe I'm supposed to open them all? Maybe? Maybe it's a puzzle piece? Maybe it gives you. It an can't egg. be that quick. So I don't know. You figured whoever lives here hears all these goddamn footsteps and be like, "Here's me, yeah, uh, yeah." Just stomping around like an idiot. Okay, so more blood glasses. Wait, see, man. There we go. <coughs> and see what the fuck happens. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> Hi. Oh, my God. Just rips your throat out. Um, okay. You thirsty? You gonna put it down? Get some water? Or just look at me funny? That's cool, too. Oh, no. She'll, she's... She wanted to get down. I know I gotta go up there, but she just went up there. Why do you have to go up there? Because I have the eye, and I think oh, it goes in that nun thing up that there. The portrait. Yeah. For the door. Bottles of blood. 
gotta be, right? Um, I mean, what do you think, man? Fill up the drawer first. The winemaking techniques of Castel Dimitro, so I don't know, can be traced as far back as the 15th century, long before the current occupants of the castle. Alcina, or Alcina, Dimitri so uh, <laughs> uses this legendary yet peculiar technique to enrich the wines, a flavor intensely, and bestow it with a thick bouquet. Uh, there, or, excuse me, her best vintage is Sangui Virginis. Meaning maiden's blood, or virgin's blood, it is kept in a, a special ordinate bottle decorated with intricate silver flowers. Okay. So I'm probably going to get one of those here soon, aren't I? Oh, skulls. <coughs> Gotta be something in here. Yeah, one open a thing just to tell. Well, maybe you have to look for the wine, that particular wine bottle in the cellar. I mean, <coughs> I was in the cellar, but. Oh, okay. Missed that. Why is the key so scary? <laughs> it's like, oh fuck, you gotta go outside. <laughs> All right, so that's where the floor was that I got the ring in, the dining room, right? Right. He does have kind of like a... I'm, I'm Jesus Christ. That's not creepy. think. <laughs> no, but wouldn't that destroy you? Maybe you're not playing him. Yeah. Maybe, maybe this is the intro to yeah. the thing. Wow, that was pretty good. I know it's right. it's kind of freaky. The, that the whole like shrouded fly lady that bit you kind of freaked me out a little bit. Oh yeah, absolutely. That was pretty cre creepy. Um, yeah, I, I would say the setting's a little cooler. This is more my vibe than dilapidated. I, I, I'm watching you. Oh god, I was like, oh no. <laughs> It was, but I do wish there was a little bit more ghostly effect. I have a game that we should play maybe uh, once is uh, v v uh, Visage. Okay. It's a game that's like in the style of PT for those that know what that is out there. No. Um, but uh, yeah, it's it's super creepy. I could only play it for a little while because no. it scares the shit out of me. <laughs> I mean, hey, this this wasn't even that bad, and I was freaked out for from Jump Start. You could see me cringy a little bit while I'm on my phone, so. I oh, mean, yeah. uh, I mean. Anyway, this is a little quick one. We wanted to, we wanted to check it out both of us, and then on top of that, you know, we wanted you to get a get a peek at it for people who don't have PS Five. We know it's still kind of scarce and hard to come by, so you know, drop us a like, subscribe to our channel, and thanks for checking us out. We're yeah. Channel Couch Co-op. Later, guys. Peace out.